we're seeing right now from hip-hop artist to survivor, a Denver rapper getting ready to run the rocks after beating lung cancer. And this morning, he's sharing his story. Nipper joins us this morning. Uh, good to have you, by the Thank way. You. Thank so, you. So, uh, let's talk about your story. I mean, you, you, you didn't notice anything wrong. In fact, you didn't even go to the doctor for what ended up being the problem. That's correct. Uh, I was having at work, I had a little back injury, so I went uh, to the emergency room. Yeah. It came back, uh, your back's fine, we didn't see any room, but we found a little smudge, and it could be cancerous. In the emergency mm. room, dog, he just laid it on me. You know, you could have chemo, radiation. I'm like, whoa, you wow. know. I didn't even come in for I a problem just, like what that. What about my back? Right, yeah. so, uh, <laughs> right. you know, a couple of weeks, they did the test, the C-scan uh, came back, it was, then they did the oh um, actual, you know, and, Yes, it was part they of the part of your lung? Yeah. The surgery happened March 1st. They took oh. the top left of my lung. How long yeah. goes that? March 1st. That was, this, yeah, this yeah, this year. Oh you should be doing all right. I'm yeah. doing it. Well, fantastic. fantastic. I'm doing it. I'm doing, I'm still so doing it. So what causes? Were you a smoker? I was a light smoker. I smoked, you know, um, you know, I wasn't like a pack a day, maybe sure. 10 cigarettes, if any, in a couple of days. But I thought that was, you know, the thing. And I started... Uh, being that I got in contact with the American Lung Association, I started networking different people. Yeah. Yeah. They're like, are you sure you got that from smoking? And I did research. Come to find out, uh, in the 80s, I worked for the railroad. And as a painter, oh. so it's uh, the asbestos, basically. Uh, and if you smoke, both of them together. Oh. Kind of amplifies yeah. it. Yeah. yeah. So... Well, of course, you know, we've had a lot of the, the vaping-related yes. deaths and illnesses in the news lately. And with your personal story of survive, survival, what are you thinking about? It's, it's, and I understand, you know, research is key. This mm -hmm. is how am I able to have, you know, my surgery in March and be able to, you know, continue on basically yeah, you're what rock I'm and doing. Roll I'm rocking. So <laughs> that research, you know, and we don't know what's going on with vaping. Yeah. We need... You know, we need more research Does it on that. scare you, though, that it's a lot of people are still doing it? Even though and they think it's a healthier alternative Actually, to smoking. Actually, even, even um, you know, not to throw anybody on the bus, but I was told, Joe, if you have the urge to go smoke cigarettes after my surgery, go vape. Oh, wow. Oh. You know, people are like, go vape, go vape. Because they I'm said like, it was safe. Right. Yeah, or right. a healthier alternative. So, so we really, you know, and it's important. Our young people listen to me. Your lungs are important. <laughs> mm -hmm. Really, I'm 55 years old. I'm still rapping. So, you know, do this for me. I'm well, looking right at you. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Basically. This is, Talking to the people. I'm serious. Uh, honestly, this is, this is real life. This, this event is, is coming up. Run the Rocks. Definitely. So, uh, obviously, it's a great way to raise money mm -hmm. for research. Mm-hmm. So what's going on? This, so how, do you sign up ahead of time? How does it work? You can work? sign up. I'll do the online registration stops the 9th, but you can sign up uh, register there. The race starts at 9. You have oh. music throughout the course. You have beer at the finish line. Nice. You know, it's, it's a great opportunity. I might do a surprise performance with oh, a band. Wow. Nice. Yeah, yeah, that's one of my things. So it I'm seems gonna, like you're feeling up to it. Yeah. I'm doing great. I can't believe that you just had that surgery. <laughs> I know. Yeah. So it's, 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 um, that's why it's, you know, i got to share my story yeah. um, mm -hmm. and let people know that Whatever you're doing, early detection, go get that test. Go yeah. see. You know, see where you stand because that's the key to it. Well, uh, and I, you've been through heck and back, but God bless you for sharing your Thank story. Thank you so much. We're trying to make an in. impact now. Sure. Yeah, I got born, it. If that's you could save one of their life, it's one, worth it. You know, I want Thank more than so one. Much. I want 20. I <laughs> Let's do it. Aww. Thank you so much life. for having me, guys. Yeah. That event, runtherocks.org is the website if you want to sign up, get more information about the event this weekend. All right, 818, let's get over to meteorologist Brooks Garner.